Hey there, good morning. Pastor Ron, Faith Baptist Church. Um, coming back to you, an update on the house uh, that we bought for $6,000. And I talked about the other day about how we are uh, getting away from the uh, what the American dream of life on credit. Um, in the book of Psalms, it says that you shall eat of the fruit of your labor of your hands and you shall be blessed. Meaning, God blesses those who work hard. Um, you know, we live in a time where men opt to send their vehicles to get vehicle maintenance, oil changes, work done on the house, and they don't want to do anything themselves. Um, they don't take any responsibility for upkeep around their house or anything like that. They even hire people to do their lawns. But God says that you will be rewarded for the fruits of the labors by your hands and you shall be blessed we ought to remember that you know god says if a man doesn't work he doesn't eat and so i've been out here at this house i've been working since the last time i shared a video i've been cutting brush down that's really about all i've gotten done the last two days but man there's a lot of brush we i just want to give you an update kind of show you uh where we're at and what the house looks like right back here you can see the house is uncovered here on the side and there was a bunch of brush right here we cut it down we got it loaded up on the trailer uh, you look back this way all that brush there on the on the ground there um, it's all been cut and it's fallen we got to load it up on trailers and haul it off this next week I got a whole 16 foot flatbed trailer over here full of brush right now but uh, you know the other day when we went uh, and, and gave you a video you could hardly even see the house but here you can see the house you can see the house it's gonna need a little bit of roof work you, you see up here you see it's got a uh, little bit of roof work it's gonna need uh, the electrical panel over here it uh, it's gonna have to be changed out I'm gonna do that this week we're gonna get a new meter box put in and and we're gonna get hooked up with uh, two plugs um, so that we can start running saws out here and start working out here but uh, kind of give you an idea what the what the house is like it's got a carport over here and uh, right back here is carport it's got it, it fell back here right back here it kind of fell down but I'm gonna uh, it, it's in pretty good shape it just it, the back support beam just came down so we're going to uh, we're going to brace it with a four by four post and, and put it back together. We're going to paint it and it's going to look real good. Uh, it's got a little garage back here. It needs to be cleaned up, but it's got a little garage back in here. So we got a tool room. Um, it's got a it's got a porch off the back and it the porch was a screened in porch and it really just needs to be torn down. So that's on the uh the near future agenda uh to come in here and, and just rip this whole screen in porch down but uh i'll take you in the house and kind of show you what the house looks like this is the this is the kitchen here I mean, we just had eight inches of rain, and even with the roof looking like that, it uh, not a drop of water in it. It's kind of surprising. Um, came in here, they, uh, the bathroom, it needs to be gutted. Uh, we're going to gut that bathroom out. Um, this is one of the bedrooms here, and they had this old, this old tile down, and I pulled up some of it. Uh, look at this. Look at this hardwood floor. It's like... It just needs cleaned up. It's in such good condition down here. I mean, you know, really, I mean, that that looks like, <laughs> that's just dirt right there. Uh, it, it's it's almost brand new under there. It's, uh, it's pretty amazing. The old living room is probably the worst room in the house. Um, it, look, it looks like it used to have water leak, but really um, got up in the attic during the middle of the, the, the heavy rains, not a drop of water. Um, so that may be an, a, a, 
a prior issue that they had, but I uh, uncovered some of this old sheetrock in here. Look, look, shiplap walls. Oh man, it's gonna look so nice when we're done with that. Come into this other bedroom in here. Look at those pretty hardwood floors. They're dirty, but man, they're pretty. Look at that, look at that. It's pretty hardwood floor. Uh, it's gonna, it's really not, it's really not that bad. You know, we got in here, and, you know, the, uh, the electrical, it's not the best. You know, we're gonna rewire all this, get all that gutted out. We're gonna, we're gonna redo the, the plumbing in here. And, um, we're gonna tear out this back old, this old back porch here. It's pretty bad as you can tell. Look, you can see right outside. So we got sunroof, sunroof, <laughs> yeah, sunroof. Anyway, we're gonna tear this out here pretty quick, probably the next week or so. Um, but we own all this back here. Um, we're gonna put our chickens back in this lot back here. I've been out here cutting and uh, that, all that's gonna need to be mowed and weed eated and then we own a, uh, another big area on the back side. We have, a, we have a, uh, another barn in the back here. All this needs to be mowed and weed eated. It's real, real overgrown back in here, but um, I'll show you back, right back there, there's a probably a hundred year old barn right back there and uh just real cool barn wood on it and old tin and there's the there's the old well house right there and uh got to check it on the well and we got a bunch of water in that well the well's gonna be good it's gonna be easy to fix we looked into it had a well guy come out um it's gonna cost less than a thousand dollars to get the well up and running so we're excited man it's uh i mean might have hit the jackpot here you know uh i'm just so excited about this i'm so ready to 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 have that freedom so we're uh eventually we get this house cleaned up and fixed up and and get it livable we're going to uh come off the end of this house right here and we're going to extend it about 12 feet and we're going to make a master bedroom and bath in here and then we're going to rebuild this screened in porch and uh, we're actually going to turn that into a dining room and on the far side we're gonna make a washer and dryer room, uh, laundry room there. So uh, that's kind of what we got going on out here. Um, got a lot of the trees cut down. I told you it'd look a lot better once the, the brush is cut down. Um, but just want to give you an update where the house is and, and I'll keep you all posted. You know, it may not go as fast as HGTV's uh, home renovations, but they got a lot more time and money than I do. So I'm just like you, just a regular person, but I just want to keep you all updated and show you how an average person can get out of debt. God bless you.